fit and we're going to need four pale yellow fondant and four cocktail sticks so what we're gonna do is to press so that we make a long drop then we insert a cocktail stick inside and then we can insert it inside the cake or a dummy if the cocktail stick is too long we better cut it so we're gonna do the same thing with the other three bowl as well so now i'm going to add the last fruit insert the cocktail stick and put it again inside the dam with the help of a scissors it's much better each leg needs to be a little bit curved so they're all going to be curved looking the right side now we need to take another bowl of pale yellow and what we're gonna do is we're going to put it on our hand and with one finger we're going to press a little bit and create this kind of shape which this is going to be the neck now we want the body to be a bit longer so we're going to press and roll here as well and we can put it on top of the legs so that's why it didn't matter if they're not perfect because now we're going to put the body on top of it I think I've changed my mind and I would like this leg to be forward so I'm going to take the scissor gently move the cocktail stick and put it over here now we need to draw a line at the back of the foot and we need to draw a line over here now we can leave it to dry meanwhile we're going to make the head so we roll a bowl of light yellow fondant and what we're gonna do is that we have our finger we have to roll one side of the bowl now we have to pinch it and roll it again so this is the mouth now with the smallest part of the bowl tool we're going to draw the eyes I'm going to make two ovals one on the right and obviously one on the left now I'm drawing a line on the mouth make the mouth as well and two holes for the nostrils now we can feel the eye with some white fondant with some dark blue I'm going to paint the iris I'm going to cover all of the bottom and going up and cover even nearly all the top of it as well and now I'm painting the pupil with black as well so it's an oval and it goes from the 
bottom and then up now with a lighter blue I'm going to paint this part now we're going to need some black fondant and we're going to make a very thin string and now we're gonna put it on the eye And then cut and now we're going to add more small eyelashes we're going to need to put more free eyelashes here to make the eye light I'm going to add an oval of white fondant here between the iris and the pupil some more over here to make the ears we're going to need two balls of yellow fondant and we're going to press it and make kind of triangle but it hasn't got pointed ears so we have to press a little bit now with the leaf shaper we're going to make the inside of the ear now we can put it on the head now we're going to leave the head to dry and we're going to make the wings so we roll some fondant using the template I'm going to cut the first wing To make the smaller wing, we're going to cut the template again, put it on top of the rolled fondant and cut it again. Once you've done two of them, you need to take a um, toothpick, cut it in half and put it between the wings. To stick you just need some water and now we can set them very gentle onto the body if you find it hard to do with your finger you can use your scissors as well now we can insert another cocktail stick for the head and now the head now you might want to add something to hold the head while it will get dry now we're going to make lots of uh, strings pink strings to make the tails and the hair and put it in three and now we're going to stick them onto the head going down and what I like to do is to make a curl at the bottom of the hair so now I'm gonna do the same thing and now I'm going to stick them on the right and again I'm going to make a curve
Now for the towel, we're going to make bigger strings and instead of three, we're going to need five of them. And we're going to make them a bit smaller to one inch. Now I'm going to press them and make another curl at the end of this one. I'm going to insert a cocktail stick and leave it to dry because this has to be hard. To make the butterfly here, I'm going to remove one of the wings. I'm going to make the butterflies out of lots of little ovals. And with some blue, I'm going to add the butterfly center. Finally, we can add the tail. Finally, I add some glitters on the wings and the hair. I hope you liked this video, if so, please don't forget to thumbs up and if you're new to the channel, subscribe to get all my new videos. On my channel, you can find tutorials on cartoon characters, summer cake tutorials and much, much more. Have a sweet day. Bye-bye.